Hi, I would like to show you two ways that you can send your signature in on a Google Doc. The first way is relatively easy. All you have to do is sign your name on any sheet of paper and then take a picture of yourself holding the paper and that will be acceptable. So for example, if you're on a computer like I am right now and I have my Google Doc open, I can click inside the box where I want the signature to go, right below where it says signature of student. And then I am going to touch my webcam. And all I have to do is sign my name on a sheet of paper, put it right there, and make sure your name is nice and big and visible, and then hit the space bar. Now you have to know where your pictures go on your computer. Mine go into a photos folder. So I'm going to insert image, upload from computer, find my picture folder and my camera roll. And right there it is. Now, if uh, this is a good way to do it, if space is not a consideration and it also shows your teacher that it really is you that's doing the work. And you can do that for a parent signature as well. Get your parent to take a picture of themselves holding their signature. So it, you can obviously edit the picture if you want. You can just edit it so that it only shows your signature. We could, for example, crop the image. And if you wanted to take your picture out and just wanted your signature, there's an image crop of it. It's a little bit small, click on it, make it bigger. Now there is a second way that you can do it, which is also relatively easy. In Google Docs, click where you want the signature to go, click on insert, image, pardon me, I meant insert drawing, new, and now there's a little icon right here that says line. If you'll click on the drop down arrow menu, you'll see scribble. And you can now use your mouse, or if you have a touch screen, your finger or a stylus, and just scribble your name. Now, if you're on a Chromebook, in order to use the touchpad, if you hold down the left button while touching the touchpad. This will also scribble. So I am I have a touch screen. I'll just write my name on there. And if you don't like anything, you can just hit reverse and go back and fix it. So if I save and close now, there's my signature. And again, it saves it as an image. And so you can edit it. You can shrink it down if you think it's too big. But there's your signature. And you could write also the date or just type it and that would be fine. Either one of those methods is a good way to return a signature to your, to your teacher.